Wow. It's my birthday on Sunday. I'll be turning 26, but I am still currently 25 years of age in this moment. I wasn't going to do one, but all right. Hello, 30-year-old Dodie. <laughs> Firstly, a very happy late birthday. You're welcome. Did you watch 13 Going on 30 to celebrate? Did you have a birthday bash? Your first album, Build the Problem, Problem. has been out a while now. How did it go? How was it received? <sighs> what album are you on now? What songs have you written? What are they about? <laughs> Here's your face. What do you think? Here's your makeup. How are the dirty dots? Can you, can you still put them on? Or are you just too wrinkly? Do they disappear into the folds of your eyes? <laughs> Sorry, I'm joking. In return, what do you find terribly cringy about the way I look and act right now? Hmm? Go on, roast me. This is your living room, but this is your bedroom. Uh, you're currently waiting on um, moving to LA. You thought that was going to happen, so you didn't actually buy a proper bed to sleep in. So um, your neck hurts quite a lot all the time. You love a novelty bed, you. What does your bed look like now? Hmm? Anyone sleeping in it with you? You painted the room over lockdown and prepped it. You actually thought you were going to be living alone, but you don't. You live with Martin and Gret. They're the best. I wonder if being alone to you feels as awful as it does and did to me. Or are you older now and you enjoy alone time? Are you one of those people? Brain is still bad. A bit. Hi, editing journey here. Your brain actually isn't that bad. I just don't think you were feeling well when you were recording this. Quite a lot of the time, it's alright. Okay. Um... But, you know, understandable considering the circumstances. Still spaced out, still derealized. Where are you at with that now? Have you had any moments of relief? Are you back? Probably not. And that's okay. Now, I mentioned lockdown. I'd love to document my thoughts while I'm in it. You can have some lockdowny things to look back on. There was the summer where you lived with Hazel. And that was actually really nice. Did a lot of balcony sunbathing. Hazel baked banana brick. And then successfully banana bread. Oh my god, why are there so many motorbikes? What's everyone doing? Ordering Uber Eats? Does Uber Eats still exist? Deliveroo? Hmm? Is there a new competitor? There were the NHS claps on Thursday evening. That felt like a really weird time. You definitely got the sense that history was being written. It was all a novelty at first and then I think everyone started to go a bit feral. Everyone was trying to police the right thing to do so there was a while where you'd get cancelled for wearing a mask because you were taking it away from people who needed it and then now you get cancelled if you don't wear a mask. What is going on? But that's just everyone trying to gain control when you don't have any. <laughs> Can you do this still? <laughs> there are announcements everywhere to wear a mask at all times. And there are adverts saying, we miss you, we'll see you soon. It all felt very apocalyptic at first, but now it just feels feels normal. It's funny how your brain adapts in stressful times. It's weird to think that something I've mourned will come back. That doesn't usually happen. It feels really strange that I used to be able to go out and do things. Like I was in a video game and I could spend time by going to the cinema or to a museum. I really hope that you take full advantage of that and use your time wisely by having so many great memories to look back on because that's all I have at the moment. <laughs> I sound like an old lady. I sound like you, an old lady. I can't wait to go out and do things with the people I love. Speaking of, how are your friends? How is... I'm reluctant to name anyone because obviously life changes and that is weird. I, I was alright last time. But how is... How's Hazel? How's Sammy? How's Dan? Evan? Martin? Gret? Orla? Josh? Shannon? Jack? Lucy? Hannah? Bethan? Rosiana? Okay. Ooh, who are the new friends you've made? Who do you know now that you can't believe that I don't know? What is the new experience that you've had that you can't believe I haven't had yet? Good or bad? What is your new favourite piece of art? What have you seen that I haven't seen yet? The last thing I saw in the cinema before lockdown was Portrait of a Lady on Fire. Oh, Please watch that again if you've forgotten how good that is. There you go. Treat for you. What is the new social media? Because currently TikTok is on top. TikTok. I wonder how you feel about that media now. Yeah, I wonder if it's all a little outdated now. Okay, let's get deep again. Come on, come on. What does time feel like to you? Because life feels long currently. After looking back at all of that old footage of us as a child it blows my mind how far away childhood feels it feels like another universe like another life so much happened does that feeling of time passing shrink the older you get like does five years feel as big as it did passing from 20 to 25 or did it go by in the blink of an eye maybe not that much has changed because um you know you're more likely to settle now that you're older 
Have you settled? Oh my god. Um, how's your family? How's your man? How's your sister? How's your brother? Is Grandad still kicking? He would be a hundred years old, if so. Um, have you figured out the other thing? Because I am still struggling. Do you have a cat yet? Do you have a car yet? Can you drive? I tried learning manual over lockdown, um, but it's just too hard. I have to concentrate on not killing anyone. I reckon it's automatic all the way now, so. Is it 2030? Yes. No. 2025. No, yes. Yes, I'm cheating. That's not that far away. I really thought it'd be 2030 by, by then. No, that's really not that far away. Yeah, how's the planet, hmm? How's the state of the world? Here's your phone. This is your background, palm trees, Miss in LA. We've got no home button, but we do have face ID. What's next? Are they like see-through yet? Like see-through phones, is that a thing? How's your heart? Ooh, how's your body? Do you have one less gallbladder and four less wisdom teeth? Or did you not have the balls to do that yet? Can you do anything impressive that I can't do back here? You know, can you do the splits? Can you play uh, something on a musical instrument that I can't play here? I don't know. I've run out of notes now, so I'm talking freely. I wonder where you've been. I wonder what you've done. I wonder who you love. I wonder who you miss. It doesn't seem that long. It really doesn't. All right, I will. I'll wrap up. I just hope wherever you are, um, you know that I love you and I am in you. Remember to look after me and all of the other young dodies so that we can look after ourselves. Yes. Oh man! Right, good luck. Dry your eyes. <laughs> I don't know, maybe not crying this time. Who knows? Who knows? I find it fascinating that things have happened that I can't even conceptualise because I don't have the experience, the, the time or the life to even imagine it. I just have no idea. Life is wild. Mm, okay, I'm gonna have a big cup of tea, which I take with either sugar or honey and a lot of oat milk. I wonder if everyone is vegan. <laughs> okay, bye. Oh, also, this is your favorite color, obviously. What is it now? Do you hate sage green now? Oh. Bye! Bye-bye. Bye-bye.